welcome to another video and you probably noticed that the wind direction and the speed in the upper right corner changes. So every time you hit the track or hit the menus and hit retry, it changes. So it kind of was a good feature, it had a kind of a good intention, but it just doesn't give everyone the same conditions on the track, as this is where you set your best qualifying time for daily race. I mean, it's probably not fair as it should be. So I decided to see what kind of impact it actually had on the car performance. So you can actually see me lining up the cars, you can actually see me kind of trying to get the best possible result out of this, and you can actually see the difference. So it's quite a, I would say it's not a very big difference, but even those little, I would say a little few extra kilometers per hour here or there, it's just gonna make a lot of difference in the end. So if you're losing 50, 20, 30, 40, thousands of a second each time you do this, then you are in trouble. And as I said before, you can just press retry to change it. And of course, we're gonna move on to daily race A because I wanted to see like, okay, what kind of impact it had on slower cars. So the cars that don't have additional horsepower, it's just very slow. This is an electric car, so you can see it's only in, uh, only in drive. It doesn't really gives you a lot of power to work with. And I just wanted to see, okay, what kind of performance boost or loss is this gonna get? I mean, I was, you know, I was just lining up the cars as previously, just, uh, just from the start, and then you can actually hit 100. So the difference is just one kilometer per hour. But in slower classes, as you go all the way around the lap, it kind of means a lot. But we will skip on to this next challenge. And this is the drag race where you're trying to get 400 kilometers per hour on the Malasan straight. And the difference is pretty significant. So this is one, uh, this is the one that I probably, you know, I probably hated doing the most. So I just didn't see the difference. I just couldn't see, okay, what was I doing wrong? I was hitting, I, I, I couldn't even hit the, I couldn't even hit the silver medal. And in the end, I figured out, okay, it's probably because of the wind. And as you can see, on the left hand side, you got my new record, 406 kilometers per hour. And on the right, you can actually see 399. I don't think that's fair, honestly. So in the comments down there, just let me know what do you think about this whole thing and should we remove this feature from every, I, I like it in the game, but I would really like to remove it from every kind of daily race qualifying session or licenses like these. Thank you very much guys for watching and let me know down in the comments what do you think. Bye.